Hi my friends. Today we'll discuss about templates for uh, creating drawings. This is a very important uh, thing because uh, it uh, uh, helps you to uh, uh, be more efficient using uh, a template and uh, uh, in time uh, you can refine it ending with uh, proper um, efficiency in work. Before anything else to apply what I'll tell you next uh, I have to advise you that uh, you have to prior to any other thing to change here use style library read only with read write there is no uh, difficult thing right click read write yes without this uh, what I'll tell you next uh, uh, will be not possible save done and now we open we open this part as you remember if I start a drawing I can place any view of one part one of the activities is to uh, apply dimensions for instance here to this arc not circle. Dimension click here and you remember uh, that I have to eliminate this uh, trailing zeros. To do this I activate styles and uh, standard editor the great library of uh, settings for uh, inventor and I have to eliminate this trailing zeros for uh, length units not angular units if I apply now save this is ok another setting is to apply some settings to create a shorter line in this direction and to create a gap between the end of the dimension and the edge of part. To do this again we activate styles editor we go to display and we change here with one millimeter and one millimeter I apply save and you will see changes here yes this is small and this is created the gap okay after this we want to place a dimension here like this one but we want to have the center and to make this setting again and again we go to options and instead of this we select this save nothing changed save and close nothing changed I have to erase this and the uh, next one 
I put it there is a center here good but this is to be done uh, to every uh, drawing if I close all this uh, drawing when I start again I also have to eliminate zeros trailing zeros to place here the other changes it must be a way to save these settings somehow and then to use uh, uh, this uh, new uh, state to other drawings this is uh, uh, why we discuss about templates I close this drawing without saving. I'll start a new drawing using the same template like, like uh, before. I make changes from the start moment now it's it means. I eliminate this I go to display I change this with the uh, one tab one and I go to uh, options to change the uh, style of radius dimension and now I'll save this um, default ISO this is the template you use currently if you uh, follow the uh, procedure I presented I want to save this in the style but I cannot do because of uh, this not activated option to have it activated I save before the setting and then I can save to style library that uh, settings save and close and now I know that here can be used for instance base ok drawing uh, annotate and radius here is without the trailing zeros everybody understand home I apply undo undo to have nothing here and I go to save as save copy as template and I save this uh, this drawing in the template which is somewhere in the uh, on the disk I go here and I save it just over the former mm -hmm. template yes do you want to replace it yes I do yes and now I can close the drawing which has no relevance to us and then when I start again with uh, using this modified template I I'll be very happy to find out that uh, all is as I want to be annotate dimension 
radius, diameter, you see smaller ends and the gap and here a radius okay yes that's all you have to know that uh, there are a lot of uh, possibilities in changing the template for instance you can change the font here to do this you have to change definitions here and to save them after you make changes and then right click here and save to style library but not only to default ISO but to any other elements here for instance about the text the note text is uh, current used also for um, dimensions text here note text ISO is the uh, How can I? I I want to show you these fonts and the uh, its dimension. If I change the note text here or clicking on the editor, let me do this and to choose larger letters when I save this you see these are larger as well now if I want to uh, keep this in the uh, template if you want now to save this new setting you have to save this yes save to style library I applied save here so I can save but after this I have to save uh, the template, the drawing. Let me do this. Save to library. Close. Erase the view. Delete the view. Yes, I do. And home to see all the drawing. And now I save this as a template, a new template over the last one yes I replace it okay now I can leave this uh, drawing and when I start again with the modified template of course I place a view okay I go to dimension and you can see here the greater uh, height of the uh, text a lot of things can be associated with a template and we'll see during uh, this series of uh, uh, tutorials how to do um, you have to remember this uh, um, tutorial number 29 because you will uh, work with it in the future in the case this uh, procedure does not work like uh, you saw here uh, there is a possibility to use this uh, tool update then uh, uh, you will see here some lines of, uh, of uh, data 
you will click yes to all okay because there are documents which are uh, older than the uh, version of uh, inventor you use and uh, they must be updated other way the procedure uh, is good and uh, you can use it uh, whenever you need to change something in order to have a proper setting set of settings uh, to work with bye bye